banks and financial institutions conduct risk and control assessment with an objective of identifying, measuring, and monitoring operational risk within the organization and controls are instituted to mitigate such risk. Assessment of risks could be qualitative, quantitative, or both. Qualitative assessment of risk is done on the judgment of the person assessing risk and risk is generally classified into high, medium and low categories. However, it is subject to bias and assessment can differ between person to person. Quantitative assessment of risk, on the other hand, is done using numbers assigned to likelihood of occurrence of risk event, and its impact to the organization. Unlike judgmental classification of risk through qualitative assessment, risk classification in quantitative assessment is based on the score band assigned to each class. This method of assessment is more scientific and freer from bias. Once risk is assessed, the risk manager should think of way for its better communication to the management. Risk heat map is Perhaps, the best option for communicating the results of a risk assessment process, visually, and in a meaningful, and concise way. Risk heat map is a graphical representation of risk assessment results, where the individual values contained in a matrix, are represented as colors based on risk scores. The heat map shows the management which risk to manage more importantly. Operational risks are generally assessed and measured based on its likelihood of occurrence of risk event and its impact to the organization. Likelihood and significance of each risk is rated in 1 to 5 scale. Likelihood of occurrence of risk event is classified into, rare, unlikely, possible, likely, and certain, and, are assigned score of 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 respectively. Possible impact of risk event to the organization is classified into, insignificant, minor, significant, major, and catastrophic, and, are assigned score of 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 respectively. The overall risk score risk is computed using the formula. Risk score equals to likelihood score multiplied by impact score. Once risk score is obtained, it is plotted in a 5 by 5 matrix. In each cell of the matrix, risk score value is plotted. We can create score band for risk classification. For example, we can assign low risk category for scores from 1 to 5, moderate risk category for score from 6 to 10, high risk category for scores from 11 to 16, and extreme risk category for scores above 16. A bank can compute risk score of a particular risk event, and plot to the appropriate place at the risk heat map. Same process could be followed for another risk event, and so on. Mm -hmm.